but thank God you got here because like I said, it's less traumatic. It was okay. so hard on her. God, it was sad. So sad. It's all right. She's sleeping. Yep, she's sleeping. Well, I'm here for the Spay Nooner event for my two dogs, my two pit bulls, Raider and Dreamer. Dreamer, she's not an aggressive dog at all. She actually loves people and loves other animals. Today would probably be because she's really scared. She doesn't know where she's at. She's really nervous. I'll be right back for you. Want to get ready to do Raider next? My dog, his name is Raider, because I'm a Raider fan. Uh, he has an um, anger towards other dogs. Well, I'm trying to calm that down. Raider is this kennel over here. And it's not, I don't want my dog going through this, man. But I have to be a grown up about it and make the right decision for everybody. So I guess what we'll do is we'll just have you bring him over there. You guys don't stick your cameras in this dog's face, or you will not want to do it ever again. When Edward walked Raider out of the kennel, I was relieved. It was like a walk in the park for them, and it was just because he was with his owner. So with him, it seems like we'll be able to do yeah. FIV. So much easier yeah. with him here, yeah. Because trust me, I guarantee he would have acted like her. Because yeah. <laughs> they're either really yeah. attached to them, yeah. they're owners. <laughs> She's going to give him a shot. So you kind of hold on. Come on, Raider. Good boy. There you go, there you go. With Edward and Cynthia here to keep Raider calm, getting him sedated was a lot easier than with Dreamer. But this could be a traumatic experience, even for the owners. Okay. He's okay. Yeah, he's okay. He's okay. No green is when um they cut his um you know his um what I call I call it manhood. It's cut it cut his manhood away. It's a very, very, very hard decision. Words cannot describe the feeling I have. I love the dog. I hope she's in good hands. And I hope he wakes up and nothing happens.